Central Florida leaders address coronavirus concerns after two confirmed cases are reported on Florida's west coast. Less than 30 minutes ago, Orange County leaders addressed those concerns of the virus. This is News 6 at 5. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. They say the county is ready and is taking steps to prevent the spread. News 6's Eric Von Inken is live in the newsroom, breaking down the new developments for us. Eric? Lisa, Matt, the Orange County Mayor and the Orlando Mayor just finished a press conference saying that they are ready for this. Orange County will set up a hotline by tomorrow for people to call if they have any concerns about the coronavirus. The county and the city are already taking precautions, they say, like sanitizing public facilities and ambulances and treating people who call with symptoms more carefully. The Orange County Health Department has tested fewer than 10 people for the coronavirus, but currently they're monitoring about 30 folks for the next two weeks with two cases in Florida but well outside of Orange County we believe it is a matter of time before we have a case right here in our backyard we want to emphasize that while the coronavirus moves at a fast pace we are remaining calm and have been working behind the scenes uh, with our partners at the Florida Department of Health Florida's governor declared a health emergency, we told you last night, which gets Florida whatever it needs to handle the coronavirus and makes doctors and hospitals report all suspected cases directly to the health department. The governor said this afternoon there will be more cases showing up in Florida besides the two on Florida's west coast. That young woman and older man are in stable condition and in isolation, and doctors are checking anyone who came into contact with those patients. The Florida Health Department will now test anyone for coronavirus virus if they're showing signs of severe lower respiratory illness, things like pneumonia, even if they haven't traveled to any countries with outbreaks. The Surgeon General says coronavirus is a lot like the, the flu, but not as severe. Most individuals with COVID-19 will have a mild case. 80% of individuals will be able to treat it and observed at home. Up to 15% of individuals may have a more severe case requiring hospitalization. Up to 5% of individuals, this may be especially severe. In the elderly, and those individuals with underlying medical conditions, like high blood pressure, heart problems, obesity, and diabetes, may be more prone to develop serious complications should they contract COVID-19. Again, the takeaway here is there is no reason to panic. Most people are going to be fine and won't even have to go to the hospital. In fact, doctors are saying the flu is a lot worse than coronavirus. And we just learned President Trump has been invited to speak at a global health conference here in Central Florida next Monday in Orlando. We're asking the White House right now if the president will accept that invitation. Eric Von Eyck getting results. News 6. Lisa. Eric, thank you. ClickOrlando.com has a number of articles on the coronavirus. We have an interactive of maps showing the areas where the virus is the worst. Just look under the health tab.